Hey guys, so as you can see by the title of the video, it's time to say bye bye to Simply Safe and hello to Boundary. Home security made smarter. Now, Boundary did reach out to me, asked if I could do a video, and uh, this video is obviously sponsored as well. Now, this particular video is not me setting up this, uh, this system at the moment, it's just a brief chat on how I got on with Simply Safe. And then we'll open that box and have a quick look at what's in there. They sent out the medium um, package uh, that you can see on over on their website. I uh, also want to talk about the plans as well. They have three plans. You have a three, uh, which is free, $9.99 a month, and then $24.99 a month as well. Obviously containing different things. But you can use this system without paying a monthly fee if you want to. And that brings me on to Simply Safe because that, that's how I've ended up using Simply Safe. I've sort of neglected the system in a way, really. Uh, I stopped paying the monthly fee and I just used it as a standalone security system. So whenever I go out, I set it to a way which arms the, uh, the motion sensors and obviously the entry sensors on the windows and the doors as well. I've got the alarm in the kitchen. Let me quickly show you. Right, come on. Let's take this off. Oh, let's go for a little tour, shall we? So if you did watch my video on the Simply Safe installation in 2019, I think it was, you'll see uh, there's a sensor there in the top. That sensor's still standing or sticking to the wall. I also had a sensor in the top corner there. That fell off last year and I didn't put it back up because I couldn't be bothered. The sticky pads did sort of fail and they fell off. And you might remember the keypad, the Simply Safe keypad. You can set to away, we've done all that. Uh, home, this is the, oh, off. There we go. Yeah, so the keypad is still here. Uh, I can tell you the batteries lasted around about nearly two years. Um, we'll just set it off again. Nearly two years they lasted uh, with Duracell batteries. These Kodak batteries are rubbish. They last maybe every few months. Yep, so this will be going as well. Let me talk to you about the, the entry sensors. A bit grubby now. I can tell you now, the batteries are still going strong on there. Batteries, excellent on the sensor there. We also have a sensor on the other window there. You can see battery life, excellent. And obviously the, the motion sensors, I've not had to change the batteries for them either. So yeah, I mean, I've been using it. I still use it now. I used it the other day, I said it while I was out. Obviously, because it's, I haven't got the app or anything installed, um, then I'm not gonna get any triggers, but the alarm should scare people off anyway. And then as far as the base station goes, the base station is here. That's the base station collecting dust. Um, runs on power but it does have about 24 hours on battery if you unplug it as well. So yeah, that this is gonna be the end of the, the Simply Safe security system. I remember at the start I had some teething issues with uh, pets, because uh, the cats did actually set them off, but they did have um, sort of sensitivity buttons which was turned down low. But yeah, this is, this is the end. We also had a camera as well, um, which I stopped using. But a fresh approach now with the new boundary system. And like I said, they sent out the medium bundle and you also get the siren with that as well. Yeah, so this is the bundle I was sent, the medium bundle with an outdoor siren. And you also get two months free smart plan as well. 319 pound at the moment. So in a moment, we're gonna check the box and just have a look at the, uh, a few of the things in there. Now, these are the monthly plans that I was talking about earlier. So we have the light version, up to five users, unlimited sensors, arm and disarm from the app, which I think is great. That's um, a really good thing. Uh, partial arming and compatible with Amazon Alexa and Google Home. And then smart looks like the best value according to them. Uh, the extra little bits on here, you get activity alerts, pet sensitivity, nighttime reminders, automated key holder calling, extended warranty, and a few other things as well. And then if you look at the pro version, 24 seven professional monitoring and immediate police response uh, as well. And free battery maintenance, uh, replacement, sorry. But as you can see there at the bottom, this plan requires a professional alarm installation, which costs 199. 
Now, one of the things that attracted me to Simply Safe was the fact that you could install it yourself, you know, DIY, and that's exactly how you're supposed to be able to do it with the boundary system as well. You can get someone in to do it if you want, but I'm gonna try and do it all myself, and that's what's gonna happen in part two. The next video is gonna be the full installation and setup of the boundary system. But now, let's have a quick look in the box and see what we get in the medium bundle. Okay, so this is the box. Home security made smarter. And another little cheeky thing to put on the bottom lot. We know you're smart, but now I'm upside down. That's a clever little touch. Who thought of that? It's the little things, the little details, you know. Pull to open. So already, look, as soon as you open the box, you have instructions there. Download the app, set up your hub. Simple. As soon as you start, there's already instructions there, straight in your eyes, not in your eyes. Setup guide, right there. A couple of protected by boundary stickers, good. The hub, so this is basically what the keypad was with the Simply Safe. See the hub there, look. Good. We have another box here. Sensors and fobs, designed in the UK. I like the use of card as well, there's card everywhere. Card. And the outdoor siren. Ooh. So that's it, that's the medium bundle. Yeah. Okay. It's like this. Wow. Nice. I'm not gonna peel any protective stickers off yet until they're fully installed. But there we go, the boundary alarm system. Oh look, and you get a little spirit level there at the top. See that, to make sure it's level, obviously, it's spirit level. Okay, so this should be, this should be lots of fun. What's this? Oh, you get some wall plugs and screws, the mount, is that it? Look, and again, some instructions also. Install your siren on the front of your house so that it's clearly visible to passers-by and potential intruders. Your siren should be mounted high enough to be out of reach from intruders as well. When installing on the outside wall, the lower two wall fittings rotate to help with finding the fixings. Clever. So that's the siren, guys. Sensors and the fobs. Oh, wow. Cardboard, cardboard everywhere. Again, look, breaks it down, motion sensors, contact sensor, and fobs. Let's have a look at one of the motion sensors very, very quickly. See, there's, there's little tips on all the boxes, look. It's great, it shows you exactly what to do. It must be mounted 2.25 meters off the ground and positioned away from reflective surfaces. Uh, there's also a little note there at the bottom that says, find your screws here, but, I won't be using screws. I'll be doing pure DIY easy 3M stickers, just like I did with the Simply Safe setup. And there's one of the sensors. Yeah, stick the strips there, I'd imagine. There we go, yeah, so the stickers. Focus. So the stickers will go on there. Bump on the wall. There's a little button there at the top. I'm not entirely sure what that is at the moment. Probably some sort of pairing button. And you have battery there. The bottom. Yeah, so I'm, I'm guessing it's gonna be pretty much the same and easy installation as Simply Safe. So you get four motion sensors in here. So I'll have a couple in the front room, a couple in maybe in the kitchen, the hallway. Contact sensors, so these will go on your doors or windows, wherever you want to put them. And obviously you can add additional ones as well from the website. Please mind the gap, the space between your contact sensor and magnet edge to edge should be 25 mil max. That's 2.5 centimeters. There they are. Again, we have an area there for the 3M stickers to stick to window or door or whatever. And yeah, there are 
they're going to be your door or window sensors, slightly bigger than the Simply Safe in terms of length, but maybe not as wide or chunky. Cool. Okay, so these key fobs. So instead of putting your pin or whatever it is to uh, disarm or arm uh, the alarm, I believe you can activate these fobs and you just have to scan it and bang you're in or you're out or whatever. And like it says here, if you do ever lose it, it's easy to deactivate. That's good. And that's it, look. Focus. Yeah, look. A hub stand. If wall placement isn't ideal for you, now this is good, this is good. The stand will come in handy. So this, I might as well jump straight to this now, the hub. Uh, the videos I've seen uh, from, I think, Troy from What Gear, um, I saw recently, he's put his on the wall. But you can, if you wish, just use the stand. So maybe for my testing, I'm gonna use the stand because that is probably the easiest way to install anything. I mean, let's have a look. Let's have a quick look. How does this mount to the wall? Oh. Can this mount to the wall with screws or sticky tape? Well, it looks to me as if it's just screws. Okay, so there is, there's the hub. Cool, keypad on there, digital display. There's the back of the hub. And we also have a power lead as well with oh, a Type-C cable. Not seen that before, that's cool. I was expecting like a, um, like a DC sort of mains plug. USB Type-C, I like that. Okay, so that comes off. I worked that out all by myself. I didn't need to watch any manuals or anything. So that clips up and there's a USB Type-C port at the top there, I don't know if you can see that. That's good, cable goes straight in there. Cool, so it's not operated on batteries. So I think for my installation to make sure it's really, really, really easy DIY, is maybe just for you to stand, but we'll see. But, I have to install the outdoor siren. I might get someone to do that. We'll see. But yeah, that's it. That's what's included in the medium bundle from uh, Boundary. Uh, I'll include some links in the description below if you want to go and check out their, their website and have a look at some of the pack packages and their sort of um, their monthly plans as well, just to get an idea of what they do and what they sort of provide. Uh, and then in the next video, part two, I will do a full installation, just like I did with the Simply Safe video, to show you how easy or how difficult it might be to set up. I'm thinking it's gonna be quite easy though, so yeah. Thank you all very much for watching. Any questions, pop them in the comments down below, and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.